is my first Walmart clearance video of the year. I know it's been a long time since I've done one of these videos. I was taking a couple of weeks off from clearance to let it like recoup, I guess, from Christmas. So I'm really excited to jump in and see what we find. I just walked in and look at this big thing. It's going for $25. Oh my goodness, it's so big. It's got a little heart. It's a big old shark. They have a bunch of different like animals. That is so cute. My daughter was never into the whole um, stuffed animals. And then like you have these ones, the characters for 20. You have old Yoda, not baby Yoda. And then all the Valentine's Day stuff is out. I might do a separate video for Valentine's Day just because I love that holiday and I feel like it needs its moment. Um, there's definitely a duplicate of that at the Dollar Tree for a dollar of this one right here. So, and then like they always have the little like garland type briefs. Dollar Tree definitely has those. And then you have all your picks and stuff. and. I just bought some lovebirds. These are cute. So yeah, I think I might do a separate video just cause like I said, I love this holiday. So I never saw these during the holiday season, but these are actually really, really cute. They're $10, so they're a bit pricier than the other ones that are like seven right over there. These are cute. Definitely love these. Over here we have all of these discounted toys. Um, to be honest, I don't know if I'm gonna really get into many of these, like the scooters. These are all 20, it's saying. And then we have like other ones for 15. Like, LOL hair vibes. I think these were going for 15, I could be wrong, are now seven. So things are definitely cheaper actually some Christmas leftover it looks like they're sprinkles cookie cutters um, these soap dispensers that I saw earlier in the year that light up which really are cool these are all 75% off so it looks like just like candy canes and baked goods and then peace on earth that's nice I wonder how much that is let's see how much this huge, is huge beautiful peace on earth sign is going for a dollar so I'm definitely picking that up I don't know <laughs> really what for yet but I definitely can give that as a gift to somebody it's crazy good so there is still more Christmas so I'm gonna get lost in the sauce and see what else I can find because if things are ringing up for a dollar I'm here for it I found these red ornaments which are perfect because I'm doing bread on a tree next year um, oops for a dollar twenty-five and then these are going for 50 cents a pop, well, 47 cents. So I'm gonna snag these for my daughter's piggy tree for next year. And then I found this, which I wanna see how much this is going for. I, oop, oh my gosh, because I really like that too. Unfortunately, this is going for 324, which is not like bad, but it's also like not with the pricing that I want it to be. So I'm gonna keep looking guys i guess i can't get all the deals in the world like this is already a great deal and then i saw this which i got so excited about this garland because i was like oh my gosh i've been wanting to do a garland but all of them don't have tags so i don't know what that's about got a lot of boxes and stuff Oof, oh my gosh so many employees just walked by they're probably like what is she doing ah, reindeer sleigh rides this is cute hmm so much stuff so much stuff that's a bigger box let me see how much this one is going it's for it's double so since it's double it's 250 which isn't bad hmm. see what else we can find metal farmhouse for 450 it's not bad at all i was not expecting this to be a christmas video guys i just want to first say that but oh. i also didn't expect there to be this much christmas stuff still floating around Hmm. Oh, I found socks. Let's see how much these are going I have for. to get out of this Christmas coma. Oh, shit. Yeah, I have to get out of here because I feel like I'm like lost in the sauce of Christmas again. Clearance aisle. And just when I thought I was safe, 
Lord help me, my husband is gonna have a heart attack when he finds out I bought more Christmas stuff. Okay, so right away I see like Christmas CDs, but I'm gonna scan these. I'm telling you, you should just go to the Goodwill because they're gonna be probably better priced. So let's see how much this stuff is going all for. All these are down to $1.24. Like all these signs that have like this, where you can stick a stick in them. And then that good tidings is three something. I think it was like three twenty four, but not bad. And they still have, oops, they still have a lot of options and a lot of them still have the stick too. So you can use it a couple of different ways. I really like this one, Christmas tree farm one. Not bad. Uh, ooh, let's see how much this be Mary sign is going for. This is like super rustic looking. This is pretty. Let's see how much this is. By the way, the socks were 74 cents. So that's a snag. This little outdoor adventure set going for five. Another lantern that is going for nine. And then we have like these slumber, Lion King and Baby Shark. Those are eight. And then these bad boys are now down to $7. So, and then we have an Instapot egg for seven. And this guy is going for nine. I'm guessing that's for a game. And then a delicate wash <laughs> for your delicates uh, for $2.88. Bubbly bath mist. We're gonna snag this. This is a dollar. Also, the Be Mary was going for a little over um, $3. I think it was $3.20. 324 324 then we got some hats up here that are saying they're a dollar 98 i'm sure they're cheaper and then look at these oh these are so cute Ooh, let's see how much those are and we'll check on the hats Returns are 47 cents and these are actually a cent more they're a dollar 99 for these hats so oops and then we have a lot of like these tasty kits and then this magic pad Huh. That's interesting. That's going for this one says 15, but this one says seven. So I think they're double priced down. Let me check for on that. These are in fact going for seven dollars. These magic pads. Skull cups are three dollars. Oh my gosh. Look at that big old guy. Well, that is down to twenty-eight oh six. And I don't know why they don't just donate these to like a charity or something because no one is buying those. We have some cups for 25 cents it looks like. These are nice too. Hmm. Look at all the baby stuff. Ooh, ooh balls. These are $2. That's actually a really great deal for those I think. Lots of baby gifts for 10. If you have a Cricut, you could totally monogram the blanket with the baby's name. Such a cute gift. Look at this one. This is so cute. I found this and I was so upset because I wanted this when I saw it in the store. It is 11, so it was originally 22. So this is not really that good of a deal, but it's still better than 22. So stunning. And there's no cracks or anything in it. I just can't justify it. Ugh. Cause I already bought a mini Christmas tree. So, hmm, what else can we find? On this one for nine. Oh my gosh, guys, this is killing me today. On the day that I said I was gonna stop buying because I watched a video from a YouTuber named Sarah. Her video will be down below. I'll post the link as well and her channel. And she has this rule that she follows and I love it. It's if you cannot buy it twice, do not buy it at all. And yes, obviously I can buy that twice, but uh, do I really need it? Look, they have two of them too. Oh my gosh, this is such torture, guys. And they have also a bunch of those metal lanterns. So that's like four. So maybe they'll price them down because it looks like they're not moving. Let's see how much these little sets are going. Normally these are cheap, so... We have ponies and soldiers. Let's see how much so these the are going ponies for. are coming up uh, $2 and the soldiers are coming up $4. So that's a great deal. This is $8. Um, 
my pillow. That is 19. I don't know what that is. And then pop-up tent is going for 11. The LOL dollhouse. This one is going for 90. Hmm. And I think that's about it besides like all of these um, like kits to build stuff. This is all I'm really finding guys. But this has been an awesome video. I've definitely found a lot of great deals and I'm really shocked that they still have stuff out and or not cleared out yet. So awesome stuff. And then and we have flannels that look like this for six dollars originally $8.72 and then we have these long sleeve tees that are originally $4.84 going for three and then lastly we have these ones like these waffle I don't know what type of material this is like waffle I don't know anyway they are going for seven originally ten so Finally, we got some clearance in men, guys. These beautiful tees that were a dollar at the Walmart I normally am not too fond of are $2 here. So I definitely got a deal when I snagged those a while back before Christmas. So $2 here. My OOTD bum chic, yes. I'm wearing my husband's sweatpants. The genius that I am, I parked on the wrong side of Walmart. Great. And I got a lot of crazy good deals. So I will show you those once I get home. So in total, I spent a little over um, $16, which I think is great for everything that I got. And that was my dog. Um, and mainly that's because of the things that were not on clearance. So I got two bags of corn. They're like a dollar, I think, like 90 some cents or 80 some cents. My daughter needed a new toothbrush. That was five. And then the strawberries, those were... Um, Three. So that was like 10 right there. So that's really where my all the money really went. But um, I picked up these. These were $1.50. I think this is a great deal. I don't know how much they were originally going for. But um, either way, I'm really happy that I got these because now next year I don't have to buy them. And they're like in the package still nice and fresh for next year. Then I went ahead and got these. These were 74 cents. I think these are really pretty on trees and it'll go with the red. So perfect. I picked up this uh, bubbly bath dust. It was a dollar. Normally I would never buy something for a dollar. I always wait until it's like 50 cents or 75 cents. But today's my daughter's first day back to school. So I figured she would really enjoy that for her bath. Um, these were 74 cents. This is crazy. I love fuzzy socks. I love these socks. I've said that in previous videos. So whenever Christmas stuff goes on sale, I always go and get these because that's when I get them. And to be honest, I will rock these all year round because I crushed it for this haul. I went ahead and got these. These were 47 cents. I think these are so cute. Next year, I'm doing a pink tree for my daughter with piggies on them for her bedroom because she loves pigs. So I thought these would be cute with the pig ornaments that I picked up from uh, Hobby Lobby for their sale. And I just realized this one's broken. I didn't even notice that in the store, but it's okay. We'll work with it. And then, oops, that's it. My kitchen is like a mess in the background. But, so this was an item of the haul that I am so excited for. It's this Peace on Earth sign. And this only cost me a dollar. A dollar. I don't know if it was their mistake. I don't know if this is really going for a dollar. But I knew I was not going to question it. I knew I wasn't going to ask for help. I was just going to ring it up myself get it for a dollar and, and be on my way. I am so excited about this purchase. This, um, si these si signs like this normally go for like 20 bucks. I'm pretty sure this was going for 20. I'm not too sure, but either way, like I said, I wasn't questioning it. I was just going to get it and go. So super excited about this. Once again, all this Christmas, Christmas items, they came out so cheap and so affordable. I'm so thankful. And, um, yeah, I'm just happy to be back in my Walmart grind. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys at my next Walmart.